Hello, 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 hello. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. How is everyone doing? Good to see you all again. Oh my goodness. Hold on, let me... Let me turn off the green screen because... Just to emphasize the uh, chaos that I'm currently living in. Oof. <laughs> Which actually doesn't look that much different from the usual behind the scenes shot. But you can definitely tell it's, there's far less stuff on those shelves over there. And look, like half the mugs have disappeared. Uh, <laughs> so it really doesn't sound like I've done much packing at all. But I've done like, I've done like five boxes. A surprising amount of boxes. I didn't think... I didn't think I would have so many boxes to fill. But they're, they're still still coming. Still more to do. Goodness me. Oh, gosh. This song didn't play in the intro, did it? This one in particular? Take five? Alright. Hey, hello, everyone. Big White Bear. Come Code. Yodo. Theo. Hello, welcome. Art Glitch. Klaus. Walter Mata. Chimera. Akubo. Strike, Carl Saturo, Sarah Man. Hey everyone, let me unpause alerts. Big White Bear. With the resub. Tier 3 resub. Jeez Louise. 26 months. Whoa. Damn! Hi. <laughs> well, hi to you too. Hi to you too, Big White Bear. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the resub. Welcome back. And hey, Quiet Artist, how you doing? Of course, come code. Hello, hello. Thank you for the 79 months. Yeah, I, th I thought I would. I thought I would do a quick stream before I forget exactly how to speak and how all of this stuff works. And also, I missed you guys. I know I haven't even been in the Discord very much. I mean, I've been, I've been looking every now and then, reacting, usually with a load wow. But uh, it's not doesn't. It's not quite the same as a full-on stream. But yeah, this is. It's not gonna be like a full. This is not gonna be a full on stream today. Uh. What? <laughs> okay. Alright, well, that's. Into it. Wait, what, what's going on here? Is it. Stream starting what soon. A miracle? Crap is happening here. Am I getting a phone call or what? Nope. What? Why did. Huh? I don't know. Okay. Alright, that was a strange. Deviation. It's a little messier, if anything. So many boxes and so much left. Oh. oh man. Oh man, hold on. Load high. Copy day is bad. I didn't want to open up a new bag of hot chaka because I usually mix the hot chaka with the coffee powder to make it a bit more flavorful. But I didn't want to open up a whole new bag just before the move, so I thought I would just stick with straight coffee powder. Oh god. Uh, oh man, I've already missed so many things. Oh gosh. Carol Satura with the 11. That's not a chose. We are used to worse conditions in your streaming room. And there is no cake. <laughs> That's not a chowus. <laughs> chowus. Chowus Bella. Oh god. So cross the terror with the eleven. Sarah Man with seventy seven. Thank you very much, Sarah Man. Time to move with us. Come and live we chat. You will be okay. Nothing wrong at all. So you are moving soon. Soon time move. Du bist, bist du un einer Mann. Bist du un einer Mann? Bist du un einer Mann? What does that mean? Are you... Are you under a man? Un einer Mann. Are you... <laughs> are you a man? Thank you, Yoda. Thank you for the 41 months in... Keller Renton, 85 months, Please goodness put me. My sub in a box. That box little down there, which I remember now. We did achieve draw game. So, we got draw game to do as well. Excellent. Good to, good to do some drawing before I completely forget how to draw. Because, oh my god. 
Maggie. Thank you very much, Maggie. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so Keller entered 85, Maggie with 17, and then Welter Meta. With 100 bits. That's not a chels. We are used to worse conditions in your streaming room. And there is no cake. I, wait, hold on. Oh my goodness, Walter Maddox. Your 100 bits message was also your welcoming message. Your VIP welcome message. So much chalice in today's stream. Goodness me. And Miss Shard, welcome back. Eight months. Which yes, is... Almost full term. Little premature. <laughs> Just like me. I think I was a little bit of premature. I'm not sure. I don't know. I hate it when you have good ideas. Might ex might explain all my premature uh sentences. Try raise girl. Choo choo. Fifty eight months. Welcome back, try raise girl. Oh man. Still waking up. Um <clears throat> Uh, let me answer some qu some questions as well. <laughs> hype train. We are so close. Oh to my goodness! Train. I haven't seen. Come on. I haven't seen one of those in a long while. I haven't heard those words in fifty years. Hype train. Goodness me. Uh, <laughs> we'll see. Uh, Big white bear. Will your PO box be changing? Yes, it will be changing. Oh my god. Oh my, wait. Uh oh. I totally forgot we even have it. I thought I disabled this. Oh my god. What is. What does this mean? <laughs> I completely forgot we had an actual hype train overlay. Sweet. Good job, me. Thank you so much for, for uh, unlocking it, Akubo. Choo -choo. 18. Thank you very much. Actually, well, no, it wasn't a coup that unlocked. It was actually Weltramata gifted a sub to Exocomics. The, the rewards thingy here is out of out of. Wait, One, two, what's it? Pull. Wait, what happened? What? Oh, Maggie! Wait, wait, hold up, phone. Wait, Maggie, how come you're? Oh, I see. There you are. It's Maggie. Oh my goodness. That was Weltramata. Thank you very much, Weltramata, gifting a sub to Exocomics. But who kicked it off? Uh, for the hype train it was actually Maggie. Gift and a sub to Kaiser Roll Bureau. Congrats. I'm not sure why your gift sub is not showing up on this... On my stream elements, uh... Chronological order thing. Maybe it's because it's like a special hype train... Gift sub thingy? I'm not sure. 52 Marie! Months. That's like a year. Oh my goodness. With, with tier 2, that's almost like 5 years. Thank you very much, Marie. Welcome back. Hope you're doing well. Goodness me. Thank you very much, Aeneas. Thank you very much, Maggie, and Valtrimata, and Kubo. Excellent. That's two draw them words, I believe. Let's get into it. I'll keep draw. I'll keep. I'll keep talking while we keep drawing. So let's jump over right now. And um, get your words in. Song to something a bit more upbeat. Um, it, um, <clears throat> but yeah, big white bear. New PO box will be happening. I I'm pretty sure I've disabled the current PO box address everywhere, so you shouldn't be able to see the old one anymore. Klaus. Lola, 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 Lola. Bonnie, 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 Bonnie. <laughs> Perfect timing. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was the absolute perfect timing. Thank you very much, class, for the 500 bits and for the the very beautiful Lola Bunny song, serenading song. Thank you very much.
What's it? Zoomer. We type train level for a hot tub stream. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you very much, Walter Mata. Thank you very much. I don't actually have a hot tub. Uh, if I if I were forced to do a hot tub stream, it'd probably be me like sitting with one foot in, in each saucepan filled with hot water. That's, that's about as hot tubby as it can get. Um, unless I bust out the garden hose or something and just completely destroy this place before we move out. Give me a virtual hot tub. Oh, that's true. <laughs> virtual hot tub. That's right. I don't even know why I was thinking of physical, like an actual proper stage when, you know, you guys are so used to just complete bare bones. <laughs> bare bones chaos in the background. Oh, God, there's so much to do. Anyway, 56 word is words to do to choose from which three will we be drawing first they are boxes oh. fluffy moon all right fluffy and moon both from big white bear uh which one to re-roll keep fluffy re-roll moon re-roll moon keep fluffy 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 is hard to draw. <laughs> Fluffy boxes. What the? Okay. Well, we're not gonna we're not gonna start off with easy. We're gonna reroll. Moon. Oh, hype train! Hype train is success. Success. Thank you so much, everyone. Hype train completed level three. Goodness me! I've received a level two hype train emote. What the hell is this? Is this the Roblox? What is that? Is that a, is that a Roblox? Reporting in. Danger dance. Choo choo danger dance. I don't know. <clears throat> I thought it was something. Maybe it's a Fortnite dance. I don't know. Anyway, boxes, fluffy signs. Those are the three words we'll be drawing first. There's another door them words after this, so if you've got some more words you want to throw into the mix, keep them in your mind for now, and uh, you'll have an opportunity to do that uh, very soon. Um, uh, excuse me, some phlegm in my throat. I'm not sick anymore. I mean, physically at least. I took a COVID test. I'm COVID negative. That's good. Um, but man, what a what a what a crazy. <laughs> What an unfortunate series of events where just before I start moving house, I get sick with I, which I assume was COVID. I don't know. I, I think it was definitely felt like a milder version of what I had in Japan, uh, but reversed because after Japan, after the COVID I got in Japan, I for a long time felt really like just drained, not physically bad, but like mentally blah, brain blah, really bad stuff. And I, and I had actually no, I still have. I don't know. I started with that, and I'm ending with that. Oh God, I don't know what's going on. The text under the camera overlapping. Oh geez. Yeah, this this hype train is completely. I forgot we had the hype train overlay. Um. That is. Wait, let me see if I can fix this. Using a button. Can I fix this? Hey. Two draw games. Make it three. You're an honest fluffy donor in a box. Hey, thank you very much for your your <laughs> for your fluffy donations. Three draw them words. Goodness me. Goodness me, thank you very much. Um Oh here it is. Oh no, not that. Oh gosh, is it? Uh, oh, I have made it worse. Uh, cool, fixed it. I'm, I'm talking about the little bar here. Hey, to power, how you doing? <clears throat> Good to see you. Good to see you. Very impromptu stream today. Impromptu stream. Uh, it's gonna be mostly a draw them words stream now. A little bit of an update and a draw them words. So, without further ado, let me get my pen here. Let me get my digital pen as well. 
Let me get some music. Let me open up the Clip Studio Paint. Just feel it, Bob. Hey, bonjour, Bob. How are you doing? Oh. Okay, here we go. I think this is all working. And of course, we need our Spider Man song. Okay. The three words boxes, fluffy, signs. Fluffy. Uh, I'll say fire fry. Did I say hello to you yet? I'm not sure. <sighs> Boxes, fluffy signs. Gosh, gosh, oh gosh. Okay, start. I haven't picked up a pen in so long. I'm not sure why, why I've associated Fluffy with ginormous, but here we go. This music makes it so much more disturbing. It's just a couple of soft toys in a box. Two minutes. Oh god, how am I gonna... F how am I gonna color this in? Uh... There's so many gaps in the fluffiness. <laughs> I think it's probably best if I just actually don't fill it in and I just kind of fill it in by hand. Old school style.
Uh, uh, it's one minute left. Oh, gosh, this is not good. Why do I have to start so intensely? Twenty seven seconds. I signed up. Now. Oh. Done. <laughs> that oh, is a singular sign. So, oh, uh, that's there we go. Signs, <laughs> multiple signs. Okay, and it's supposed to be fluffy. It's not just poorly colored in. Um. <clears throat> That was a tough one. I didn't even get around to doing any shading. Ridiculous. Anyway, uh, that was more of a warm up one. We got, we got, how many more? We got two more, two more Northern words to do, anyways. So this is a warm up one. Let's get this out of here. Uh, let's see, how do I do this again? I export. Push this button. And then I push this button. And that means it's in the Discord. And if you want to post your own, it's in the Discord right now. So let's see. Yeah, so there it is. If you'd like to share yours, do so. <laughs> kind of hoping that no one else has done any. Actually, what, what, what are we talking about? It's not even. I've brought in the the Lola Bunny isn't even part of the three words. All it is is boxes, fluffy, and science. I've made it weird. So if anything, I'd love to see your version and see what uh, what a, a good attempt would have been. Let's see. They only look so bloated because they soaked up a lot of liquid. Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Hold on, making it all blurred makes it even worse. There we go. I'll, I'll I'll reveal it. I see someone's typing. I think it's a Yodo. I think a Yodo is posting one. We'll see. I'll say yeah. Uh, Anria, hello, hello, hello. Hope you're feeling a bit better. Hey, Anria. I'm feeling better now that you're here. Good to see you again. Oh my god. <laughs> Yodo. Lola Bunny is implied. Okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is a Yoda's one. So remember, boxes, fluffy, sign. So it's Lola Bunny looking as fluffy as ever, holding a box, and there's a sign behind her. I've somehow convinced Lola Bunny to help me move. One little box at a time. Excellent. And there, oh, there, there she is as well. Uh... Damn, Yoda, Yoda, have you been practicing while we've been away? I feel like, <laughs> I feel like your your uh, Lola Bunny AI generations have uh, become even more polished <clears throat> over time. God damn. Anyway, good job. Good job. <laughs> uh. Uh. Wait. Wait. 
Wait. Hold on, am I breaking my eyes for a second? Oh no, there, there it is. Yoda, for some reason there was a bunch of chat that happened all at once. Yoda, wow, is that Lola? She do be looking cute. <laughs> Yoda is, uh, forgot to sign into his alt account. <laughs> you're, you're typing from your main account. A TFC toast as well, welcome back. All right, good job, <laughs> Yoda. Now let's see um, a few AI ones from Raltram Rata. This time, uh, not so perverse, hopefully. They are as such. Boof. <clears throat> hey, a loading eyes box. A bunch of fluff on top. Actually, now that I think about it, yeah, that, that would be good, uh, good packing materials to keep whatever I've put in the box from uh, destroying itself. Though, this looks more like... What's it called? What's that stuff that you put in your house and it's really poisonous? Well, it's not poisonous. It's a uh, pink bat. Pink bat stuff. The insulation, I think it's like... What's it called? Fiberglass? I think it's like a little a bunch of little bit bunches of shards, like cotton candy, but the flavor is glass. That's what that looks like. Yeah, pink pink bat. Is that what it's called in uh, your country as well, or is it just a New Zealand thing? I'm not sure. Not asbestos. It's, it's, it's like it's like legitimate. Klaus Klaus will know what I'm talking about. Fiberglass insulation. Yeah, there we go. We call it glass wool. Hmm. That makes more sense. More sense than pink bat. <laughs> Which almost just sounds like pink bed. And you definitely don't want to sleep on that. Okay, right, let's see the other one. Oh. A whole box just for one soft toy. That is just amateur hour for packing. Also, goddamn, look at that intense wooden sign. <laughs> I have to have a sign like that drilled into every box that I move just to make sure it goes to the right house. And look at this, loading artist. Listen, a nip is a duder. <laughs> New loading artist merch in store today. Not even in stores, in just one store. Reporting in. <laughs> you have to find it. Hey, Dak, welcome, Dak. What an entrance. Dak, welcome back. And uh, Walter Mata, thank you for your AI uh, interpretations. Now we got a few from Labob. I had a concept but didn't get enough time and tried multiple times, so here is it all. I had a concept but didn't have enough time. Okay, well, let's see. Let's see. The first one. Do not open. No. No touch. It's multiple signs. All right, you've already beaten me there. And it's a box, but it's fluffy. Kind of looks like one of those, uh, what, are the, what are they called? The, the, from Dark Souls, the treasure chest that you try and open, but they chomp you. Mimics. Yeah, it looks kind of like a mimic. Treasure chest with a big mouth. And we also have this one. Uh, <laughs> I like how we, it almost looks like a story. Like we start off here and then we kind of slowly back, back away behind the police line. And then even more signs here. Box, multiple boxes, all fluffy, multiple signs. Excellent. Well, I think, I think your concept and your execution was flawless. You uh, you ticked all the boxes there. Je suis le Bob. Good job. Or should I say, je suis le box. <laughs> also, Bob was the only one to actually, yeah, actually, actually draw something and not use AI. So good job again to je suis le Bob for that. Notice how it's humans are applauding that one. We should we should have a different applause where it's not human hands. But it's like robot hands, and we use that one for the, the AI ones. <laughs> so only humans applaud humans. Whatever that. Anyway, <clears throat> good job, everyone. And uh, let's get out of here. Sweet. Okay. Get ready. Starting now. Um. Oh, anyway, wait, wait! <laughs> Are you adding words now, sweet? We also have a third. We've got another one to do after this one. So if you didn't manage to get your word in on time for this one, we have a third draw them words coming right after. Hey, grass cut it. You didn't get a mail notification from Twitch for the stream somehow? 
Oh dear. Twitch doesn't even think it's worth worth mentioning that Loading Artist has gone live. This guy? Twitch is like, this guy's streaming. Thought he was dead. Eh, probably is dead. Hey, Jamamp. Book when? Book when load gag. Hey, Jamamp. Jamamp the champ. 89 months. Looking forward to working on the. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. I'm actually gonna be starting to work on a book after I move. I've told my agent. That's when I'm actually gonna. Even my agent is emailing me. Emailing me. Just the email is just book. Like the subject head is book. The context, like the, the the body says when. Book when. What? I just want to be done because I heard you talking about. It. I want to hear what. You're oh yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's so. Even my agent is hounding me about it. <laughs> I know. I've. I, why do I have an agent? Do you have an agent now? I know. I've, I'm really putting the the agent before the book here. No, but that's normal. You want to have an agent so that when you get book deals. But usually, people have like a book ready to pitch, and they pitch to the agent, and the agent's like, "Oh yeah, let's oh, pitch this yeah. together." Yeah. You're but just organized. I've cut. I've somehow jumped the line. I Exit Comics let me cut in line yeah. <laughs> behind it. <laughs> I put you on the VIP list. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the only, I'm the only uh, author that has an agent, but no book. That is funny because, like, on Reddit, those publishing subreddits. Yeah. Like, so many people have written like huge books, and they just don't have an agent. Like, that's like, how way everyone is mainly. But it's cool. It's great to be in the opposite position. Yeah. I mean, I think maybe that's where they've gone wrong. They should be getting an agent first exactly. and then write the book. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and also Komika went back to regular schedule. Um, went back to regular schedule. So, hold on. Let me just let me just look at the, the calendar. What? Why are you still here? You're just laughing at me. <laughs> Um, we're moving next week. Um, you don't look at the character. The count is here. Look, Lola. No, Lola. <laughs> I mean, Lola Bunny is in the center of the screen, but the corner is where Windows oh, Windows's oh, calendar comes I down here. You told chat that you're looking at your calendar and you're just fully staring at Lola and just going, um. <laughs> Lola will tell me what to do. I have to look into her eyes. That's it. Well, I can tell chat. You're not going to be streaming next week, and probably not the week after. I'll, I'll be streaming the, the week after, but not. Uh, it won't be like regular schedule. No, It'll be like, but, I'll yeah. try. I'll try and stream when I can. But as far as regular schedule, when everything comes back to normal, oh, the, week, the week, the week, the week after that is my birthday. The week after, move in. No, no. So next week is move. Oh yeah, the next week is move. The week after that is your birthday. No, it's something chaos, I guess. Oh. The week after that. Birthday. Yeah. Well, that's... Isn't that good? Because maybe you'll do a streamathon for your yeah. birthday? Yeah. So maybe the streamathon will, like, kick things off. Yeah. Back to normal schedule, St maybe. St back to normal, but with a crazy schedule to celebrate returning back to a normal schedule. Yeah. Oh, boy. we do need to do some... <clears throat> Planning for that, too. We do need to do some... Like traveling back to Auckland a few times and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. But I reckon, like, by July, you'll definitely be at normal schedule. This year? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This year. July 2024. Yes. <laughs> July 2024, we're going to be back to normal. It's this month. June is just a crazy month. Yeah. Got me so much, so much driving in front of me right now. Is there a Denny's near your house? There is no Denny's in all of Hamilton. There is no Denny's. <laughs> Denny's is a two-hour drive away from where I'm moving to. <laughs> so we'll have to, we'll have to come up with new birthday traditions. <clears throat> is there a cemetery? Um, yeah, that's actually where the house is. We live in a cemetery. Uh, it's not so much a house. It's more of a we're hole in the ground. Huh? A plot. We've, we've, we're moving into a plot. I thought we'd cut out the middleman and just go straight to the end. <laughs> Why not? Oh boy. <clears throat> oh boy, oh boy. Um, oh, I see. Anyway, yeah. 
I drew something as well. I was just late because I had to step away. Oh, that's why you were saying wait. Oh, I see. Hold on. Uh, how can I show this? Oh, yes, I can show. Mm. Oh, yeah, I can show it this way. Mm. I think. I think. Yes, I can. I can show it this way. Let's do this. Um, I go he here. Boop. Here's Anarius one for the previous boxes. Fluffy signs. That's good. I was wondering what what what's going on here. Why why is this person massaging a fluffy sign? Isn't massaging? It's boxing. Boxes. A boxing. A boxer boxes with a sign. That's. God damn it. <laughs> That's good. That's very good. Good job, Anaria. Very clever. Very very clever. Boxes. Okay, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to step it up. Goodness me. I'm gonna. I I, I feel like I'm really just. I've lowered the bar for myself. I just have devolved into just poor attempts at Lola Bunny porn. That's what I've that's what I've uh, succumbed to. Succumb is a weird word. Oh. <clears throat> I gotta start putting thought into this. Kind of default to Lola Bunny. Oh snap, a Varus Clary gift and a sub to Stroik. Hey Stroik, congrats, a Varus Clary. Thank you very much. Oh my god, that's another door. Goodness me. We have two more draw them words to do after this one. Goodness me. Thank you very much. <gasps> Excuse me. Thank you very much, Avaris Clary. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, let's 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 pick the words. Um so we got 74. Drawing words. Which three will we be drawing? They are Rainbow, Interview, Wave. Rainbow, Interview, Wave. Those are the three words. Rainbow, Interview, Wave. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, hold on. Saving the boxes, fluffy signs. File. Okay. <clears throat> oh, do I raise your chat? Is it safe to unmute now? I have kids up here. Yeah, it's safe to unmute. Safe to unmute. Actually, you can't even hear me. So I'm going to say thumbs up means it's safe. Anaria is hiding. Have a nice lurk. Well, have a good lurk. Actually, I, I shouldn't. Should I even be acknowledging when people go to lurk? I feel like that completely defeats the whole point of lurking. Uh... <laughs> um... Rainbow interview wave. Okay, I got an idea. Let's do it. Let's do it. Whoops. This is not the right word. This is not the right song. Whoops. Um... Okay, here we go. If you want to draw along, feel free to draw along. I'll make a Discord thread afterwards so you can post and share it. In the meantime, let's begin. Rainbow interview wave.
Oh my god. This looks weird now when I don't have a t-shirt. Looks like I've uh, inserted the hand of my own hand into my own body here somehow. Let me just get rid of that. There we go. Fire Fry, 39 months! Hey! What's load this? jam, load jam, load dance, how many more until another draw them words? Load ham. Fire Fry. Uh, not sure. It'll show soon. One sec. Trying to figure out a clever way of doing this. Um, One minute left, give or take. Twenty six seconds. Signs up now. Done. Rainbow interview wave. It's supposed to be like a gigantic tsunami wave. Rainbow. Coming over me. This is uh, me, being, <laughs> me being interviewed about my upcoming birthday streamathon, but it happens to be landing during Pride Month. <laughs> this, this is what this represents. Um, there we go. I think, I think, I think it's supposed to look like a wave. I don't know. Right, you can sort of see it a little bit. Eh, good enough. Thank you very much for the three words. Let's export this and uh, see what you guys have come up with. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Excuse me.
It's here. Hey, class. Oh, God. Thank you, class. Thank you very much. All right, that's a tenth to the next door game in terms of donations. And then the other one is one fifth of the way. Oops, I pushed the wrong button. Goodness me. One fifth of the way there to answer your question before Fire Fry. Um, but yeah, we do have another two after this one anyways. Right? Right? I'm, I'm losing track. I think there's two more after this. All right, let's see. Let's see. Here are the entries. First up from Jasrila Bob. Um, news. What is Go? What is what? Oh, what is going on? I think is what's supposed to be. And the person interviewing is I don't know. I don't know what this rainbow wave behind me is. Even scientists can't figure it out. <laughs> And then, yeah, rainbow waves next to a regular wave as well. Unless that's the interviewer's arm detached. IDK. I don't know. That's what that means. Excellent. I mean, obviously, everyone knows what IDK means, right? I'm not some sort of uh, cool youth expert here, right? IDK, it's pretty old school. I feel like... Um, there are so many new lingo words that I don't know, and Lee, of all people, tells it to me. She explains it what they mean. Like, riz, and what was another one? Bougie. I don't know what that... Chub... Chugi? Oh, uh, well, I, I even didn't know what bougie was, even though it's old now. You don't now. know what bougie was? No, I don't. I'm not bougie you, enough. You didn't know I rate it? I... I rate it, no. I rate that, as in I like it. I thought it was like, I rate it 8 out of 8 for the side of rice or whatever. Wasn't it? Is that, was that a meme? Like, I rate it 10 out of 10 or 8 out of 8? Are you talking about that rice meme on Reddit? With rice? Yeah. 10 out of 10 with rice? Yeah, I think. Do you even know what it's from? You're using all these memes and you don't even know where they're, where they're from. Bougie is like a real word, apparently. It's from bourgeois, the French word, which means like the upper class. Oh. It's the shortened sort of version of that. Bougie. I think the first time I read it was, I thought it was boogie. <laughs> like they're getting down to do some dance or something. Oh. They're getting boogie with it. Have you heard of people when they say, that blah 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 is sending me? Sending me? Yeah. Like oh, sending me for a spin? Like sending me? Like it's like, I'm like, kind of, usually like it's like cracking me up sort of thing. It's like making me laugh. Like I can't believe. Oh. Like, you know, like, her face in that panel is sending me. So it's like, I can't handle, like, how funny or something that, that is. Sending me into hysterics or something? Kind of, yeah, but oh. you don't say the last part. Do you know purr? Like a cat? No, they say it to mean something's good. Like a cat? You're, yeah, but you don't, you don't say, oh, it's the cat's purr, I think. You just say, oh, that's purr. Oh, they don't just start purring? No, they <laughs> just go, that's purr, and it means it's good. Like perfect? I think it's from perfect, I'm not sure. This is stupid. <laughs> just words that are shortened and halved. Riz. Riz is charisma, by the way. I like drip, at least, is something completely different. I don't even know where drip came from, but... <clears throat> anyway, I'm drowning. Drowning in all these terrible new, new age words. Dripping with bling. Is that what it's from? <laughs> Which is another bling. I mean, bling, I know what bling is. It's when things are shiny and sparkling. Blingling. <sighs> okay, anyway. Let's see, where are we at? That was a complete distraction. Uh, here we go. Anyway, good job, through Sweet Led Bob. Uh, Sebon. Now, next up, we got Dak. Why are you gay? <laughs> Dak being interviewed. <laughs> wearing a wavy rainbow. Oh, no, 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 no. Wearing a rainbow shirt, but the Dak's waving. 
waving his little paw. By the way, can I just say, that is a disturbing way of drawing, like, a human paw. <laughs> I've never seen it before. It really doesn't make it look cute at all. Like, the little the jelly beans being so detached? Scary looking. <laughs> I think a paw is cute because there's no fingers. It's just this little, like, paw print. But then when you grow the fingers... <sniffs> scary. Hands in general are kind of scary looking. Tentacles at the end of our limbs. Imagine, I mean, imagine if our toes were as long as our fingers. Wouldn't that be weird? Now imagine that, but on your hands. It's the same thing. Anyway, good job, Dak. Uh, Veltrum Rata. There we go. Obviously a picture of me being interviewed, and behind me is a rainbow wave. And the other one, <laughs> I'm slowly getting distracted by a, someone in a off-brand Lolo costume. <laughs> is this, this, this is, has to be, you, I, I assume, well, traumatic, you fed it my image, or at least a description of my image, right? Surely this isn't just a crazy coincidence with the orange, like, loading artist uh, microphone as well. <laughs> Looks good. I also like the little, uh, the yellow, orange, what's it called? Uh, fill, fill tone? Tone? Half tone? Uh, background gradient thing. Classic. Good job, Ralton Ratchet and AI. Next up we have... What the hell is this, Yoyoto? She is ready for the interview. <laughs> and you all know what I mean by she. She is waving, and in some of them there are waves. Also, it's quite hard to try and draw and generate different things at the same time. So, <laughs> uh, I think, is this, hold on, let me see. This is Lola Bunny waving, and she's got rainbow hair. I assume this is Yoyoto's drawing, okay. And then, this is after. Did you, wait, is this, did you plug this into uh, your AI thingy? Like, this is your mock-up, and then it turned it into this? No, oh, it didn't? Oh, okay. Phew. <laughs> Phew. God damn. Suits just make everyone hotter. Shake my head. That's a, that is a power suit, huh? Very cool. Nice fit. Excellent. And then we also have... Oh, cute. Uh, the rainbow hair really works well with this. I also like the um the the water texture thingy in the background. It looks nice. Anyways. Oh and also the tail of course, yes. <laughs> Why does she have a long tail? I, I don't know. <laughs> Yo Yoda is getting around the copyright infringement notices, I suppose. Uh di diversifying. They're slowly turning Lola Bunny into, like, a foxy lady. There we go. Good job, Yoyoto. Next up, we have Quiet Artist. Let's see. I meant skills in Excel, but that is pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> Excellent. A job interview. And they're demonstrating their skills by doing a wavy rainbow on a piece of paper. Very cute. Very, very cute. Um, although, they're not doing it the right way. The classic way of doing this, you hold all the, you hold all the pencils in one hand, and you just, you just draw with, in one fell swoop, you'll have all the rainbow colors. See? It's just, I learned that from The Simpsons. When Bart tells Lisa how to do the writing on the chalkboard, and you, you put the chalk on this, like, some sort of stick apparatus, and then you just like write once, and it writes it five times. That was cool. Very smite. Anyway, very cute. Good job, Quiet Artist. And, uh, oh, just Srila Bob has uh, added some colors to the original entry. Nice. Very cool. And, uh, oh, I see now. So the, those are hills, and it's like a 
instead of a traditional rainbow that has a start and finish, it's like a never-ending rainbow. What is going on? Scientists do not know. That would be trippy to see. Oops. Good job. Anyway, good job, everyone. Now, let's get out of here. Ooh. And uh, I think we have... I think we have two more. Do we have two, two Dwarven Words to do? I think so. We definitely have at least one. I think it's two. So let's jump straight back in, shall we? Add your words, say now. I'm going to interview. Cool. Hey, welcome back, Anaria. Back from your lurk. Klaus, you're not allowed a mug. This one, my Discord partner mug. <laughs> I know, Discord keeps sending me emails threatening me with legal action. They're, they're trying to force me to send the mug back to them since I've lost my Discord partnership. I bet they'll have to take it out of my cold, dead hands. Which could be any day, basically, because I'm so dead inside. Yeah. <clears throat> Until then, I shall enjoy the sweet... The sweet, the sweet nectar from better days when I used to be a Discord partner. Isn't Discord partnership over? It is, which is even more frustrating because it means everyone that is that was currently a Discord partner when they ended it remains a, they they remain a Discord partner and have all the benefits forever. So, so had we had we still been a partner at that point when they decided to cease the uh, the partnership plan? We could have had those benefits for the rest of our lives. Ah, oh, whatever. What are the benefits? I can't even remember now. <laughs> I don't even remember, but I think it's like... I, I thought we didn't... I think we didn't have to worry about like server boosting or something. Was it not, wasn't that one of the things? You have like... The benefits of like, I don't know. I have, I don't, I don't actually know to be honest. I don't know. I just want it. Well, hey, first thing, hello, hello. First thing, what is that next to your name? Oh, Minecraft, fifteenth anniversary celebration. Ah, cute. For a second, I thought that was a rune pickaxe from RuneScape. Uh, am I moving or something? I sure am. Check this out. Oops, okay, don't, okay, I don't have much how to get there. Wait, check. Check, check. Check this out. Okay, it just looks like a slightly messier room, but, uh, like, all that stuff is, like, most of those stuff are, most of the things are empty. I mean, look at this. Ah, uh, empty shelves. Look at that. Ah. Uh? The other ones are still full. <laughs> this one's empty though. Cool. Yeah. Uh, empty as well. Bunch of stuff. Uh. Yeah, bit a bit chaotic, a bit messy here, but uh, we're slowly working, working our way through. Yeah. Anyway. Um. What, what am I doing? Let's see. <laughs> 
A five right, congrats on that spider. Hold on. It really doesn't feel like, or doesn't look like I've packed much, but I really I have. I've done a lot. It's like I've, I've packed like five boxes worth. So it really doesn't look all that much. <clears throat> um, am I leaving the window panels for the next person? Uh, the, the styrofoam things? Uh, I don't know. It's not, it's not a very good look, though, is it? Huh? The styrofoam. Styrofoam windows doesn't look all that great, um, but they're useful, huh? Not sure yet. Also, let's see what the, the three words are before I keep talking. We got 68 or maybe 67 unique words. <laughs> uh, let's see which three we're drawing this time. Decision. Reroll. Peel. Okay, what's reroll? Flork. Decision. Flork. Peel. Uh, what is a flork? Well, flork's not actually a real word. <laughs> Gonna reroll flork. Boop. Plain. Jimamp. It's trembling with rage right now. <laughs> what a whiplash! A whiplash of emotions. Yeah, Flock of Cows is a fellow webcomic artist. Well, fellow webcomic, right? Wait, is that the name of the artist as well as the comic? I'm not sure. Then again, my comic's called Loading Artist, and I'm called Loading Artist. That makes sense. I don't want to because Flock of Cows already has enough problems with people ripping off his, his comic and art style, I don't want to add fuel to that fire. Even though I know in the context it makes it's perfectly harmless. But I still don't want to make it look like even out of context. You know what? You know? He said he's okay with it and retweets all of his fan art? Eh. Eh. Still better err er, er, on the side of caution. I assume that most places force you to clean out everything or else you lose part of or all of security deposit. Uh, I assume that most places force you to clean out everything. Right, I see it. The, yeah, well, um, it's going to be a little while. Even after we move out, we're still going to have to come back and fix some stuff. Uh, like the guest toilet flusher uh, button thingy broke. Don't even use the gas toilet. It's a uh, paste's toilet. <laughs> and also, paste does not know we're, we're moving yet. No, come cut. I'm. I. I'd, I'd love to tell paste that we're moving. I'm trying to communicate with paste and like you know, sending thoughts into paste's head. You know, cat head to my head. But uh, I don't think paste knows what's going on. Isn't that a two hour drive? Yeah, uh, it's like an hour and a half. Well, an hour and a half to two hours between here and, and the other house. So it's a lot of driving. Decision, plain, peel. I did, I, you, ugh. I just now read the words properly in my head. How the hell are we going to draw this? Kind of regretting changing Flork now. <laughs> Decision, plain, peel. Imagine you drive and you forget pace and you have to drive one and a half hours back. No way. X Comics would never let me forget pace. And even so, I'm going to be, I'm going to be driving back and forth. 
so many times. I really have recently to do like final check, uh, and then just dropping things off at Lee's parents' place, and buying like a buying a new bed, which I'm excited about because uh, we're gonna have space for a king size bed. Never had a king before, and for the past few years, I've been sleeping on a uh, a double. Which sounds a lot bigger than it actually is. Double is pretty, pretty tight for two people. Well, two and a half, paste included. And it's also a little bit softer than the new one, because I think the current I, I, I don't think I've had a good night's sleep for years. So I'm hoping that uh, this new bed will, will fix all my problems. <clears throat> Get a sleep number. What the hell does that mean? Hmm? I'll say, is Copy coming? Is Copy gonna come see the new place? Uh, it would be cute to show Copy at some time. Yes. Would be cute to show Copy. I'd love, even just photos. I'd love to show my other cat. Like, hey, look at the house we're moving into. Although, Copy would hate it. Copy would not want to move into that house because there's no trees to climb, so. Uh, immediately, Copy would rather just stay at my parents'. Um, you may never have had a king, but with paste you always have a queen. Aww. Cute. <laughs> I wish that actually came with a queen-size bed. Double is too small. Also, sleep number bed, you can modify the firmness on each side. What, on the, on the go, on the fly, you can change the firmness? I have no idea. Whenever you want, you can change it, like, from one day to the next? How does that work? But that sounds very expensive. <laughs> a remote control? I think the only time I'll ever have a bed with a remote control is when I'm on my deathbed in the hospital. That, that's going to be the only time I'll have that pleasure. <laughs> Until then. Just a simple spring mattress for me. Also, another reason I don't want a fancy bed, aside from the insane costs associated with it, is Pace likes to sometimes hide under the bed, uh, especially when we, he thinks we're going out to see my parents or something. So I don't want to, I don't want a bed with too many like contraptions underneath it that Pace can get stuck in. You know, that kind of freaks me out. Same with couches and stuff. Um. Anyways, decision plane peel. Decision plane peel. Okay, I got an idea. Let's do it. Again, again, and again, and again. I feel like a Netflix ad. Guitar Piper, 79 months. Welcome back, Guitar Piper. But yeah, uh, you can slope it up so you can read a book. I don't really understand that. Couldn't you just use a couple pillows to like prop yourself up so you can read a book? Seems pretty extravagant to get a bed that can like bend at at your will when a couple pillows will just do fine. But then again, I'm, I'm sure I sound like a caveman. Like, why get a car when you can just, you know, jump on a horse? Anyway, what am I doing? Oh, I'm way too... I missed, I missed the start of that song. Whoops. <laughs> Let's go. Five minutes. Decision plane peel.
that I don't know how bananas <laughs> grow on trees here, but that one's up here, okay? I don't know. I was like, congrats on that spider, big white bear. Two minutes left. Time for some shading. Some specs. Not sure what else I can do here. Just messing around here until uh, time runs out. Three, two, one. Time's up now. Uh, let's see here. Um, oh, yes, yeah, yeah, so. I found out also, yeah, beds, you're supposed to rotate as well. You rotate beds every now and then to, so that you kind of like 
stop it from sagging where you're sleeping or something. And if one person's sleeping in the bed, they should always sleep in the middle so that it kind of evens it out, apparently. Bed science. Um, why are the bananas bad if it's freshly picked? The bananas are bad? These... Oh, I don't mind a few spots on a banana. Uh, it gives it a bit of personality. Personally, yeah, I personally, I prefer a, a, quite a yellow banana. I don't like it too green. <laughs> I don't like a banana when they're too stiff, really. It, it's too sweet. Not, not really a big fan. But I don't like it too old either, too mushy. I like one, I, I, if you try to open a banana and it kind of, like, it bends and it kind of doesn't like snap off it like kind of just like mushes away that's too soft i mean i'll still eat it i won't throw away a banana but i like it just quite just just a plain yellow banana a couple spots here and there i like freckles yeah that is my favorite kind of banana also class you're meant to flip the mattress but you never do uh apparently i asked the lady at the bed store if i should flip it and she said no I forget why. Why did she say not to flip? She said just rotate. Don't flip. At least the bed that we got. I don't know. Because I thought I heard about flipping is good, but it depends on the mattress, I guess. But the one that we're getting, no flip, just rotate. Um, hmm. If it's like foam on one side, then yeah. Yeah, I think that's the case, probably, yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sometimes not a pad on the other side. Yeah, depends on the mattress. No flip, just rotate. Anyway, speaking of uh, speaking of beds and mattresses, here's uh, the drawing, a decision plane peel. So if you don't understand it, don't worry, there's not much to get here. <laughs> because a person's picked a banana, made a decision, and has regretted it because this one is just a plain banana. Yep. It's a five minute drawing. What do you want from me? Exporting. Let's see. Exporting this now. Mm-hmm. Um, oh yeah, it's in the Discord, making a thread now. There it is. So if you want to post yours, post it now. <clears throat> Let's see here. Okay, what we got? Anaria first. Anaria. <laughs> that one. That one. Choosing the plain banana. Making a decision. Uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, to be yeah, to be fair, the other one looks kind of like it's developed a new type of mold. Like Extra toxic mold. Cute little bow, though. And a nice shading color as well, that orange shading. Very nice, very nice. Good job, Enria. Next up, we have uh, Dry Rays Girl. Help, I'm peeling. I told you to wear sunscreen. That's on you. <laughs> I was going to say, very good, Dry Rays Girl, but where are the bananas? And I just realized there there is no banana word actually. It's decision plain peel. <laughs> there doesn't have to be bananas. Cause in my head I was like, oh my god, dry rays girl. Can't believe you you read banana and you drew oranges instead. <laughs> what a goof. <laughs> but yeah, that's on me. The orange is peeling. Peeling in the sun. Clever. Very clever. Good job. That's like a full-on comic. Speaking of comics, my god. I have not made a comic in so long. 
Maybe I'll just rip this one off. I'll just copy and paste this. Hope you don't mind. <laughs> just gonna slap on the loadingartist.com watermark and uh, we're good to go. Anywho, next up, je suis le bob. I have no idea what that means and where plane go. Okay, well, let's, let's see. Fruit or peel? The game show? <laughs> Decisions, decisions. So apparently this game show is about deciding whether you want the fruit or the peel. Um, plain. I guess it, the decision is as plain as day. It's as plain as day. Obviously, you go with the fruit. There's the plain word. Good job. Good job, Bob. Oh, God. <laughs> Banana blurred. For streaming purposes, just so you see how it feels when you blur yourself eating. <laughs> oh god, what is this? Oh my god. What the hell? Okay. Alright, so first of all, First of all. This one, this one you definitely fed into AI, right, Yoro? That's your quick sketch. I could, well, I could have guessed that one. Yes, that's yours. And you gave it to AI, and they made this one. Oh my god. That's insane! Why the, f why the F am I bothering to draw? Honestly, future comic streams, I start with a sketch, I push one button, boof. Finished. The only drawback is that every comic will have to have Lola Bunny somehow, but... Look how fast this is. I also love that they're not even giving you any sort of uh, leniency on your bananas. It's like, you drew this. <laughs> We're going to draw that. They know what you're trying to go for. Hold on. Let's change the song. And finally, we also have... Very good. Very good. That is just nuts, though. That is so satisfying. Holy smokes. Like, this is like... This is a, a, a combination of all of my fetishes together. I love before and after stuff, so before, after, before, after, and I love, like, super efficient, doing things as fast as possible stuff, and this is a, a perfect combination of both of those things. Also, Lola Bunny. <laughs> Very satisfying. To be fair, the Lola has three, year, three ears in the after image. Yeah. That's close enough. <laughs> close enough. Anyway, good job, everyone. Um, let's get out of here. Also, yeah, the bananas definitely uh, have room for improvement. Don't know what's going on there, but I could work around it. Okay, one more draw them words to go. Okay, the last draw them words. Hold on, let me just save this one. Decision, plain, peel. Oop. Time to hydrate. Okay, add your words. Oh, excuse me. Oh, kitty rolls. 56 months. That's seven years. 56 months, that's seven years. Is it 12 times seven? No, it can't be. Wait, hold on, 12 times seven. No, that's not even, that's not even, I don't even know what that is. That's not seven years, that's like... 
I don't know. It's too too many numbers. I'm gonna get some more water because I've run out. Uh, in the meantime, add your words. You got one minute. To Fifty-six times twelve. No, divide by twelve. Uh. Uh. Uh, excuse me, just splash some water on my face. I didn't go, I didn't go and can find a calculator. Four years, eight months is 56 months. Ah, oh, okay, so it's almost five years. <laughs> Good to know, thank you. Um, ah, goodness. <clears throat> Eighty-three poppy words. Eighty-three. That's a lot of words. Let's see which three we will choose. Um, wait one second. You know, there's a bit of phlegm in the throat and I have to go spit it out. Man, it really sounds like I'm sick, but I'm, I really, I don't think I'm sick. I think I'm pretty fine. Although it's, it started, I started feeling more sick once I started streaming. Maybe it's all in my head. I sound fine, but like mentally though, I'm just so exhausted recently. Ugh. Which is another reason why I'm glad I'm streaming today, just to, so I'm not completely, you know, completely outside of this mindset for good. Got to make sure what it feels like a little bit. I have to remind myself what it feels like to actually speak to people and do some drawing stuff. So it's good. <sighs> okay, well, the three words are... Oh. Elvin. Oh. Sheep, nothing. <laughs> Elven, as in the race, elves. You could have just said elves, no? Elves, Elven. Um, um, sheep, elf, sheep, nothing. <gasps> um, elvish, elvish Presley. <laughs> How am I gonna draw? Nothing. Huh. 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 Hmm. Hold on, let me think about this. Hmm. I have an idea, but it's 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 not gonna work. It's it requires too much planning. Uh nah. 
Nah, 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 nah. Nah. Elven. That, is that... Here's a thought. Well, traumatic. I mean, I know it's up to my interpretation anyway, but I'm out of curiosity. Do you mean like Lord of the Rings elves? Like Legolas? Or do you mean like Santa's elves? Like the cute little ones? What were you thinking? Though, to be honest, like, yeah, both could definitely apply. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Legolas or Gregolas. More Lord of the Rings, but it's up to you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that was my thought process as well. At first, I thought Lord of the Rings elves. And then I realized, you know what? Drawing an, a Santa elf is a lot easier. <laughs> if, if even if it's not in the season of greetings. Uh, sheep, nothing. Elven, sheep, nothing. Just draw the Santa elf, remove the hat, and give it a bow and arrow. <laughs> it look, that would look like a Legolas Gimli hybrid with how small. Actually, Gimli's not small, just short. Uh, thinking, thinking, I'm thinking. Put some music on to distract people from how quiet and long this is taking. Okay, I have an idea. I think it works. Let's start. It's going to be tricky.
god. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, wait, what, what does a sheep look like? 76 seconds. And it's not like it's darker than this, I think. Is that right? Does, does that look right? I can't even tell. Does that look right anymore? Oh, wait, now the, the ears are gray as well. 25 seconds. There we go. And just one last thing. Little sky. That's it. Uh, <clears throat> there we go. Done. Five minutes. So, elven, race, sheep, nothing. These Santa elves, they want to play in the snow, but it's in the middle of summer for the Northern Hemisphere. So they've shaved the sheep of all of its wool to, to use as snow, leaving the sheep with nothing. TFC <laughs> Toaster, congrats on your get sub bump from Welcome Rata. <laughs> and that's another draw game. Just when I thought I was out, Weltramata pulls me back in. Thank you very much. We have one more draw than words to do. Uh, congrats, TFC Toaster, on one, two, the Silencia drop. <laughs> My goodness, Silencia. <laughs> Silencia bursting through the drawer. <laughs> the drawer. Draw. Oh, God. So many dwarven words, I can't even not say the words anymore. Bursting through the door with five gifted subs, giving us another dwarven words. So we have two more dwarven words due after this one. Uh, congrats to all the people that were gifted subs just then. Ken creates, Rivi creates, Count JP, J Daddy draws, and Moni Moo. Congrats on your Silencia gifted subs. Thank you very much, Silencia. Goodness me. Let's get moving. <laughs> More to draw. Exporting this one now. <clears throat> uh. Post yours. Okay. The Discord thread is up if you want to post your one. Um, and make sure you got some words in mind because we have two more draw than words to do after this one. Oh, yeah, Anaria has posted their one already, so let's see. Uh, told you, sheep can't count. I think it might be dyslexic. How many? Wait, what? Wait, what is happening? How many? The sheep is drawing an elf. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Uh. Uh? I'm confused. Wait, hold on. Oh, 11. The sheep can't count. How many are there? 
Oh, and instead of saying 11, it wants to write Elvin. So it's drawing an elf. <laughs> I definitely, my God, I didn't think this would need to be a two coffee stream today. But I'm definitely needing it. Andrea, thank you very much. I think I think I might be dyslexic, but not in just the word way, but just in all ways. I might be sheep-slexic. <laughs> Thank you very much, Anaria. Let's see here. Dry Race Girl. A red sun rises. Blood has been spilled this night. Bro, what are you talking about? There is nothing there. Very good Legolas drawing, oh my goodness, so detailed. Legolas pointing at nothing, the sheep is confused. This, that little sheep is me with Anaria's one. <laughs> Bro, what are you talking about? <laughs> I don't understand. But very good. Very, very good. Also, isn't every sunrise a red sunrise? I guess not, I don't know. I'm usually asleep. <laughs> I'm usually asleep when the sun is rising. Um, I don't know what Legolas is talking about, but it's very good. Good job, uh, Dry Rays Girl. Let's see here. This one is, who's this? Waltram Reddit? Waltram Reddit, a couple, a few AI ones. Let me just double check. Okay. Look at this. A, an elvish, kind of like a White Walker from, from Game of Thrones. Pointing at the sign that says, definitely nothing. And they're riding a sheep. <laughs> Excellent. What's this? Hold on. What is this song? Uh... Nice, nice, nice. Next, we have this one. Is that supposed to be me with the black hat? Oh, all the sheep have black hats as well. And then there are flying bunny sheep in the background too. I don't know what the hell's going on here. Black portal? Nothing, I suppose? Oh, okay. oh black hole is nothing, I see. Just what I wanted. Nothing. Very, very good. Man, that sheep has seen some stuff, huh? <laughs> Look at those sheep's eyes. They're trying to escape the black hole. Ah, oh, yeah. Well, they're coming out of it. Very good, very good. A black hole is quite the opposite of nothing. It's so much. Is it? I, I mean, I don't know. I've never been to a black hole before, but I thought the whole point of a black hole is that there's nothing in there. Like, the light cannot escape it. And then you fall into it. It's like a really deep well. And what is a well? It's nothing in the ground. Also, boy, fry, congrats on that spider. And thank you very much. Welcome, Reddit. Good job on the AI ones. Let's see. This is just Sweetlet Bob. What have you got for us? An elf is pointing up at nothing, shocking the sheep and himself. Oh, himself? Him's elf? <laughs> A black hole so much because it eats everything else? Does it eat it? Absorbs it? I don't know. I don't really know much about space. It's the soy jack meme. Wait, what is the soy? This is a soy. This is a meme? Soy jack meme? I don't know what that means. Pointing? Pointing back? Oh, 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 that one. The, the. Like this one. That. <laughs> All right, excellent. Good job, Bob. Uh, and then Yoyoto. There's nothing. The box is not there, so there's an outline of nothing. And she's asking you where you put it. Lola is not a sheep, sadly. Okay, let's see. There's nothing there. A missing box. <laughs> what are these proportions? Oh, my goodness. Uh, a strange... A religious... Sheep Lola inspired thing. We got this one. Where is it? The box is missing. 
That's my that's my face in reaction whenever I see my comic reposted without my watermark. Where is my watermark? Where is it? It's not in the corner. Where is it? <laughs> Excellent. An elfish Lola bunny. All right. Good job, everyone. Now we got two more. Two more to go. So let's. Jump straight back in. Add your words, you got 60 seconds. Playlist namer. A black hole is basically the opposite of nothing, as far as we can tell. It is so dense and packed with so much mattery that it has this great gravitational force that it even catches light. Oh, I see. Hmm. Pretty interesting stuff, I see. Because gravitational pull, the bigger the thing, the, not the bigger, but the more dense something is, right? It's more about density rather than size, the more gravitational pull it has. It's very strange. Weird stuff out there. The virus Chloe, how many more subs until another Jordan words? Uh, five more and 900 bits more. Mass, not density. Oh, it's mass, I see. Which is where the word massive comes from. Huh? All right. Density times size is mass, is it? Gosh. Anyway, we have 54 hot, hot, hot tub words. Let's see which three we're drawing this time. They are. Foggy, moth. Neutron star. Neutron star? What the hell is this? Almost looks like two words, actually. Hold on. Can I disqualify it based on that? Mm, it's two words. <laughs> oh, dear. Foggy moth neutron star. A neutron star is like... I'll allow it. It's like one thing still. It's a type of star. It's like a thing with the things. It's like ice cube. Two words, one meaning. Yeah, I'll allow it. Hey, Panda Bye. Hello. I found you from YouTube and your clips to paint tutorials helped me a lot. To, 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 to. Excited to see that you're alive. Well, hey, Panda. What's going on? Hello, hello. Thank you very much for joining us here. I'm glad my tutorials could help. Um, just doing a little, a sneaky little stream here while I'm in the process of moving house. So it's, usually I have a more regular streaming schedule, but you're lucky you caught us in a, one of the spontaneous ones until I get back to normalcy. Just doing some draw them words. And, uh, and welcome. Let's see. Okay, let's do it. I'm going to keep the song going because I'm kind of sick of the Spider-Man song for... <laughs> We've heard it so many times today. So I'm just going to keep the song going. If you want to draw along, feel free to. We'll make a Discord thread afterwards. Uh, and for now, let's start. Okay, starting with space.
neutron star. Yo. Diriolon. Diriolon? How do I say your name again? Thank you very much for the three months. Welcome back. <laughs> this is supposed to be a moth. I don't know what a moth... Is this a moth? It's... <laughs> okay. Just... Just trust that this is a moth. Do moths have tongues? They do now. Adding the fog now. Oh, we've heard the song already. Honestly, Spotify's shuffle mode is terrible. Time's up now. Okay, there we go. Foggy Moth Neutron Star. Neutron Star. <clears throat> there we go. It's a bit too purple, I think. It's not enough. Neutron Star is more bluish, I think, from the... It looks more like that. That looks a bit better. Yeah. 
That looks more that looks more like a neutron star. Um oh, one more thing I forgot to do. Uh, oh god. There we go. Just some styes. Okay, done. Give that poor moth an oxygen tank. That poor thing will suffocate. Moths don't have lungs. <laughs> uh, you silly. Also, there's air out there near this. I mean, if there's there, if there's fog, there's air. And if there wasn't air, then the moth couldn't fly because it depends on air for its little wings to push around. So, in this part of space, there's air. At least enough air for a moth to fly and breathe and. I don't know. Or maybe it is suffocating to death, and that's why it's that's why it looks like this. Anyway. Let's export. We have one more was it one more draw them words after this one? I think so. I think so. Let's see. All right, the Discord thread is up. If you want to post your version, feel free to do that. I see y y Yodo's preparing. Jamamp, his face isn't purple, and I doubt neutron stars are in the middle of nebulas, just saying. <laughs> hey, it's the, the words. The words are making me do this. I know fog doesn't surround a neutron star, obviously. <laughs> Gosh. Well, oops, oops, didn't mean to push that button. Spoilers. Is there a fog brush in Clipsu Paint? Also, on that note, where is this glue brush that everyone's talking about? I want to put glue on some places. <laughs> Not on this drawing. Dear God. I don't have the glue brush. I don't know where it is. I think it's in the Clip Studio. What it's called? No, Clip. Yeah, Clip Studio Marketplace. It's where you can download a bunch of brushes and things. I think it's called a glue brush or it's a milk brush. <laughs> I've seen it called both of those things. Um, and as far as for the, uh, if there's a fog brush, I use a custom brush for the clouds. It's called Washi Joshi Cloudy Chaotic. And it was part of some pack. I can't remember which pack it was from. One of the main, like, popular packs. I forget what it's called. But if you just search Washi Joshi, Cloudy Chaotic, <laughs> you'll probably find it. Anywho, here it is. So this is Yoda's AI one. Uh, we got a little moth. That's a moth down there. It's like a moth bowl with ears. Uh, and then a neutron star exploding amongst the fog. Very nice. And then there's... Kind of looks like Ari in the Blind Forest, does it not? It looks like Ari. I thought that was a crate full of Overwatch. Pretty cool. And yeah, that does look like... It doesn't look like a neutron star. It looks like a... Well, you know what it looks like. It looks like first-person mode... Money shot. Anyway, let's get out of here. Thank you very much, Yodo. <laughs> Dry erase girl. Hold moth. Hey, look at that. It's a moth neutron star. It's like a moth with the blue thingy. They're in fog. <laughs> kind of a hold still mother mixed with a. Is this a. Wait, what's oh, what's the original meme? Is this uh I think it doesn't say is this a butterfly because he is pointing to a butterfly. Is this a bird? A pigeon? Is this a bird? Is that is that what the original thing is? Yeah, good job, dry race girl. Next up we have Anaria. Look at that. It's a moth. 
but within it is a neutron star. And it is a little foggy in the neutron star. Is that what that is? The little blurry? I see. That's a very... Do all moths have these ridiculous fern antennae? It's kind of freaking me out, to be honest. I don't think we have those kind of moths here in New Zealand. Yeah, it looks like something out of Hollow Knight, yeah. Because it's not the first time I've seen these like big frilly uh, antennas on moths. Completely forgot about them until now. I don't think we have them in New Zealand. They look scary. But yeah, very cool. Very cool, Enria. Good job. Let's see here. Walter Rennet? Not really the right words. I think AI wants to break up with me. What? <laughs> what is going on here? Foggy Moth Neutron Star. <laughs> I'm at a complete loss of where the chickens come from. Interesting. If this was a movie, I would watch it. Next up, we have these things. I mean, they look about as mothy as my moth. Creepy palm trees. Very trippy. And then this one as well. Pretty sweet. Good job, Walter Madden. Very, very trippy. And just V Le Bob. I did not look up how a moth looked like. And yet, yours still looks better than my moth. That looks I mean if I if I were shown this and I had to guess like what what is this what is this object in the foreground? I'd probably say some sort of moth. Or a butterfly or something. So you've done a, a lot with just a few colors, which is pretty damn impressive. Looks good. And like the fog as well, you got the different shades of the. Uh, damn, that's good. Very good. Uh, good job, everyone. All right. Now let's exit. And I think we have one more draw them words to do. I think this is the last one. Yes. And after this one, I'm going to end the stream. I know it's a little bit earlier than usual, but it's because I have to. Got a lot of stuff we got to do today. Got to see our solicitor. Home loan signing documents. Uh, also, I've also drawn up a will. You know, I'm going to sign a will. Let's see. So, so many, so many adult things to do today. All right. Add your word. You got one minute. So the last one was foggy moth neutron fire. What do what font do I use for draw them words? Uh for which which one? Like these ones? This one here? I believe that is based off of my own handwriting. So I think there's like two different fonts here. There's there's this one, and then there's this one. I think this one... can't even remember what that one is. Hold on. That one's called Reach Story Regular. And the... The main one... Is my font loading artist. Dry Rays, I got a bounce doing a picnic with the younger kids. Bye and good luck with the move. Hey, well, thank you very much, Dry Rays girl. Thank you for watching. Thank you for joining and have a great picnic. That sounds very wholesome. Very, very wholesome indeed. Good luck with the ants. Don't let the ants get you. 
my my knowledge of picnics usually comes from cartoons. And in my mind, there's just like a there's like a, a like a line of ants just like marching their way into your picnic basket, and stealing all your donuts and cupcakes and stuff. That's <laughs> that's how I'm, I'm I'm envisioning the picnic to go. So watch out for that. All right. I got 67 molly mola 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 words. The three words we'll be drawing for the final draw of the words is. Administrati moist words. Oh, thank you very much. Look at this. I just got a bowl full of kiwi fruit. Yeah, the fruit, not the bird. God, wouldn't that be disturbing if I just got given a bowl of chopped up kiwi bird not only would it be disturbing but i think it's illegal you can't you're not allowed to eat kiwi birds in new zealand well good luck finding them anyway they're so rare mm. Mm. why 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 is it illegal to eat kiwi birds because they're like the national bird the national symbol it's like i don't think you're allowed to eat a, a, a bald eagle in america right I'm not sure. I don't, I don't think you're allowed to eat eagles in America. Or beavers in Canada. Or can, kangaroos in Australia. Oh no, you can eat kangaroos. Yeah, no, but people don't actually like kangaroos. They're real mean, apparently. What? Did you know that kiwi fruit aren't from New Zealand? Oh, I see. I was talking about the bird. Oh, yeah. But... We're not allowed to eat the bird. No. <laughs> no. I didn't, I didn't think so. I think you China. They're called Chinese gooseberries in some places. But New Zealand's like known for them now. Why are they both you just drip you what? drop some kiwi? Why are they both based off bird names? Gooseberries? Kiwi fruit? I, I don't know. Is it because they look like eggs? Maybe. I really have no idea. They do look they're egg shaped. Thank you. Okay. All right, administration. There is a there is a character limit, so Bob would have written administration, but I only uh, display twelve letters. As you can tell, it's cramped up there. Administration moist words. Can I say these are the worst words I've ever seen in my life? The absolute worst words, <laughs> and that's not an exaggeration. These are literally. The worst words in the English dictionary right now should be forbidden as far as drawing them anyway. How the hell do I draw administration or moist Stop or, buying time. or words? Stop it. You keep going on about how they the bad, the worst words. It's, I know it's so you can cheat and give yourself some more time. Not only that, it's trying to give me some uh, justification for re-rolling one of these words. Draw, monkey, draw! No! <sighs> Tipsy Toaster. Google says the goose in Gooseberry has been mistakenly seen as a corruption of either the Dutch word Kruisbees or the allied German Crossbear or of the earlier forms of the French Grosselilles. Walter Matter, you gotta go to bed? Alright, have a good night, Walter Matter. Thank you very much for watching and for all your support. Sleep well. Schlaf gut. Honestly, I I don't care if it sounds like I'm buying time, because there's, I can't draw these words. Administration? Moist words? Okay. Define administ... I don't even know how to define it. Administration. The process or activity of running a business, organization, etc. The management of public affairs, aka the government. I can only think of one. Why do you draw like a fish in an office signing contracts under the sea? A fish is moist? Well, f water is moist. Is water moist? Yeah. Isn't moist like damp? You wouldn't say water is damp. 
But the words have become moist due to the water. Uh. Oh, yeah. Is yeah okay. Yeah. Wait, what did you say? <laughs> the fish? What? No, no. Signing. You do it yourself. No. So you just come up with something. Okay, fine. Hey, it's easy for you to say. You didn't do like five draw them words. <laughs> I'm 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 running on empty here. Hurry up and draw the words. Everyone's waiting for it. Hurry up. Yeah, spoiler alert, Lee is not in my will. I'm going to see the lawyer today to strike her from every document. The only way that her name is in my will is for someone to blame for my death. Anyway, administration moist words. What was it? A fish suit signing underwater? Screw it. I'm just going to draw that. Let's do it. All right. Signing now. All right. Under the sea, under the sea. The power, tier two reset. Amogus sus. Thank you very much. Do, 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 do. Do do Under the sea. I don't even know. Uh.
Ocean man, take me by the hand, take me by the hand, if we understand. Ocean man. Ocean man. <laughs> Time's up, pal. All right, there we go. Hey, Theo. Hello again. How you doing? Um, administration, moist words. I think it works. An original idea just from me. Let's export. Ocean man. Take me by the hand, take me by the hand, if you understand. Ocean man. Um. Um. Post yours. Okay. The Discord is up. If you want to post your one, feel free to do that now. Do it, do it, do it. <clears throat> uh, I can't remember. Was this the last door of the words, or was there one more to do after this one? Can't remember. Ow, I just poked my eyes a little bit too far. This is the last one. This is the last one? Oh my god, we've done so many today. We've done one, two, three, four, five, six draw them words today. Goodness me. And Firefly, congrats on that spider. The power, how's your sickness going? Fun? Uh, I'm pretty much recovered sickness wise, and now I'm, I'm like all focused on moving house. Oh? Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Let's see. Anaria. Um, administer daily. Oh, administer these moist words daily. Doctor's prescription. Huh? Huh? Is that nice interpretation? I also like the way you've drawn the doctor. I like the big eyes. <laughs> very cute, very cute. Good job, Andrea. Let's see. Yodo, she's all out of words. Look how angry and moist Lola Bunny is. That is one. Looks like she's got a wedgie in her skirt. Let's see, there's this one as well. Oh my god. Yodo. <laughs> oh god. Moist Lola Bunny. Her shirt is so moist, it's, it's see-through. <laughs> you can see a little bit. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Just my eagle eyes. And uh, that's a really weird looking suit. The arms are massive. Well, they look massive because the the color. <laughs> Yo, look how angry she is. So angry. But yeah, you see, you see the translucency there, huh? God, egg. Good job, Shoto. Next up, we have Jesuila Bob. Okay, what are we looking at here? So administration moist words. So administration, filing cabinets. The person has spilled all the words from this cabinet and now is moist and everything is moist because of these moist words everywhere. I like, I really like the way you've drawn um, the person like moving their shirt up and it's all like wet and clinging to their body. That's done really well. I like sex offenders. 
I think I like sexual predators best. <laughs> Cannot remember the context of that one. Anyway, good job, just really Bob. Sebon. And uh, good job, everyone. Man, that was a... We've done a, a, quite a few today. Look at all these ones. So if you are curious to see all of them, they're waiting for you all in the Discord. And the drawings... Uh, what's it called? The drawings channel. Everyone's welcome to check that out if you'd like. And on... Those are the least not safe for work ones. You do not want to see the spicier ones. Well, now you've just piqued my interest, Yoda. DM me the spiciest one you've got. <laughs> I'll wait. <clears throat> DM them to me too, Yoda. <laughs> Let's see. Wait for real? Yeah, it's, 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 I'm curious. I'm curious. I'm just curious. Uh, um, with science. <laughs> oh man, my my wrist looked really broken there for a second. Um, I must inquire for uh for science. God, I hate that. Oh. I'm just curious because I want to get my rocks off. <laughs> and, uh, oh, I'm just reading some chat. <laughs> the, the, the blind emote TFC toaster. All right, let's see. I I really hope the sensor thing doesn't f up here. Hold on, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Hold on. I'm gonna just hide it for a second. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so the, okay, I'll describe. I won't show on stream, but Yoyoto has sent me the spicy. <laughs> The spicy Lola Bunny uh, generations here. Um, so you know how I mentioned that the the see-through top from the moisture is turning see-through? That's definitely, it wasn't just my perverted brain. That definitely is what the AI was trying to do because the other ones that, <laughs> that Yoda was sent me here, it is uh, full on just that. And you know what's really weird about Lola Bunny is that usually I'd be kind of put off from a hairy cleavage. But, but when it's Lola Bunnies, the fur is just, you know, it's just part, part of the parcel. Anyway, I'm going to close this now before I accidentally reveal anything. Thank you, Yoyoto. It's stream safe. I've seen what hentai artists draw on Twitch. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's, to be fair, it's not full on nudity, but it is perhaps one level too spicy for the loading artist stream. I don't know if that's a I don't know if that's a bridge I want to cross just yet. I feel like once we cross that bridge we can't go back. <laughs> uh, no nips as far as I can tell. The only nipples are up here. I need to get I need to get them surgically removed. <laughs> that's why I keep wearing my hat. Uh, the power. Can you believe that some of my students think that the parabola uh, is simply equal to minus 12 instead of writing 4a equals minus 12 or solving 4a? I, I cannot believe it, the power. I cannot believe it. <sighs> Too spicy for a loading hour stream. The stream where cum steps were slipped on. <laughs> well, that was the context. Robbing a sperm bank. I mean, come on. It's, it's just science. Anyway, on that note, I'm going to bounce. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. Thank you very much for watching.
this loading our stream. Uh, thank you for your patience while it's been really hectic between me being sick and now me moving house. Can't wait until we get back into a regular rhythm, a regular schedule of like drawing comics on stream and stuff like that. Congrats, Firefry, on another spider well caught. And uh, but yeah, I'm happy to have done at least one stream now just to remind you all that I'm still alive. Thank you very much for not forgetting about me. Not yet, anyway. And uh, I look forward to seeing you all again. Not sure when. Not sure where. But I think... Yeah. Yeah, I, I have no idea. <laughs> but I'll see you in the Discord anyway. Did I check if you have high-speed internet at the new house? Yes. Yes, we do. Fiber. Can't go back. So it was one of the one of the. It was actually one of the, to be honest, the top priority. Thanks for streaming, load lurk, and good night, load snug. Thank you, Super Tex. Have a good night. Uh, making sure that the place we move into it has fiber internet is like number one in my priority list. Number two was it not being currently on fire. Fiber over fire. <laughs> Those are the two things. And number three is not haunted. Well, I'm not sure about that. Haunted or not, that's an that's more of an orange flag than a red flag for me. Could make for some good content. You know, streaming and suddenly like you know, a chair gets lifted up behind me. Wouldn't that be fun? Scary. And uh one last IRL stream in Auckland. I really have I've no idea what my schedule is going to be for the next week. It's going to be nuts before the move. So much still got to do. Anyway, time to go and sign my will and home loan thingamajiggy. So uh, thank you again. Let's get out of here. I'm going to end on a, on a raid. Why not? Eh, here. Yeah. Okay. Who should we raid? Let's see. Who's live? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Check out the new raid browser. Hmm. Interesting. That's kind of neat. Eh. But who is... Who am I following? I'll check out the raid browser another time. <clears throat> um, yeah, there's a new raid browser of ours, Clary. I don't know, it just it just came up with it now. Look kind of neat, kind of interesting. It tells you about like how long they've been up for. I guess so you can tell that. So you don't accidentally raid someone who's about to, to stop streaming. But um, I think... Ooh. I want to I wanna raid uh, somebody we know. Just so we can say hello. Can't tell between art or game. Art or game. Okay, okay, okay. okay. We're going to be raiding someone. We're going to be raiding... Uh... Hippo, let's do a hippo. 